Hey everybody, Action Pack here. Today I thought we'd come at you guys with a little bit of different kind of content. I know it's a little different from our action figures that we do or our Star Wars or Legos. I was able to pick up a local Pokemon booster box from a local card store and I thought why not do a video on it. Uh, I've opened up a few of these so I got a little more experience with them. But let me know what you guys think about these. Or if we want me to just kind of stick with uh, what we've been doing, or if we want me to add Pokemon and get this type of content. Anyways, I, I picked up the Astral Radiance booster box. I know it's a little old. We got Crown Zenith coming in January, and Silver Tempest recently dropped. But I got this one just because I don't have really many Astral Radiance cards, and I was looking at the card list. Like, oh, they got some good, good hits in here. So we're we'll take the first pack, open it up. Very nice. I have 36 packs. I got this for about uh, 115, which isn't bad. So we'll see. And I know there's usually you can tell by the uh, the back of the card, not the actual card right here, but we'll find out a little in a bit. But this right here, I think this is a um, either white or black background right here. So you guys, this white outline. If it's either white or black, then um. It'll be either a good car, like it'll be either a good one, or it'll be like a hollow. So we got an energy, a Sheldon, a heavy ball, Pergly, um, probably not even going to say the Pokemon names because I cannot pronounce any of these. I'll just let you know if we got anything good. We got a, a hollow Hippodon and an a. Avaliga. I'm not too sure how to pronounce that, but I'll put the good cards off to the side. And I do have my um, top loaders and sleeves for if we get anything good. So don't worry if I I will put up the good cards in there. And don't worry about always oh, just gonna leave them to the slide. Always sleeve your good cards. Top loaders are a little extra. I would recommend doing top loaders, but because I find it more helpful. But it's really up to what you guys. Next pack. Another white background. So I'm assuming that we're going to want a black background, and I can go through this. Energy. Another hollow. And then this thing. I'm actually going to put this over here. Kind of line up these cards and stuff. You need to always keep your cards. I would kind of keep everything that you get. Even the bad ones. I mean, you can throw them away. But... I prefer to keep mine. On to our third pack. Hopefully this is good for you to see. We're working on, um, well, really, with Pokemon. Just in general with video recording. Keeping our cards. See, look, we got a nice black background. So I think this is what you want. We'll see if we get anything good. Nice energy. If you guys have any tips for me while I'm opening these, like if it's any way I'm supposed to be like doing this, let me know. Nice. Uh, kind of. I don't know what this is. It's got that star effect on it, but it is a hollow and a reverse hollow. Put that in the uh, hollow pile. And take these cards. Put them off to the side. All right. So three packs. We already got ourselves. A reverse hollow not the best not the best but we'll see there's a ton like i said 36 packs so plenty of room for good cards i believe every booster box contains one secret card as to what that secret card is i don't know but we got a nice little put that right there you got a v star these things mean nothing I don't think they do anything. I one time got these with a black background, like on here. It was black instead of um white, and I thought I was like, I was like, oh, V star, and you don't get a V star. You could potentially, but this is just like a card that they throw on here that really is nothing. You guys don't have to keep it. It's kind of a cool collectible. You might actually use it as like a divider if you want to. If you have like a box, you could kind of put that in there if it fits, but. See, oh dang. Uh, I wish I knew how to pronounce this. That's a cool card, though. Dang. Okay. Uh, maybe I am wrong, but I don't think. I oh wait, let's check out that real quick. Look at that on the sides, back of the card. That's a cool one. I don't know what that is. I don't think it's worth anything, but 
yeah i got my sleeve right here so we can go ahead and put that in here i got these really old well not like kind of old like 2017 style sleeves and stuff and then i have some top loaders i like to put my cards in just to keep them extra safe especially if you want to get it graded it is a lot better just keeps the cards in better condition yeah, that one is. It's not, it's not lined up perfectly. I can fix it, but there we go. First somewhat good pull. Hopefully the first of many. Put the rest of these back. I think this is our fourth pack. I'm not too sure. Maybe our fifth. I haven't been keeping track. Black background. Let's see, put those in the front. We got an energy, a Togetic, I think, Gusty Pickaxe, Eevee, uh, Heracross, a Mantanine, a Quillfish, a Basculin, nice hollow gaping jaw, and ooh, a Diaglio. Oh, sorry, that wasn't kind of focused. That is cool. Look at that. Origin form. I have the uh, origin form uh, Palkia V. I think that's how you say it. I'm probably wrong. Again, sorry. But I do have that. So cool. two of my kind of origin forms. These are both really cool cards. Probably not worth anything. Like you can usually tell. But that is cool. Yeah. Put sleeve that up too. Right in there. that in there tap it down put that off to the side put this over here to the side as well all right so one two good hits technically we got that uh trainer kind of card and uh we'll have probably a price tag hopefully in the uh the corner for you guys so you guys can see how much these cards that I'm getting are. And it'll just be the normal one, not the graded version. I might have gone too many normal goods. We got energy. Oh, hopefully I didn't spoil it for myself. Oh, another heavy ball. I actually kind of like that heavy ball. It's a cool design. They should add it in the Pokemon games. I don't know if Scarlet or Violet has it. Probably not. I have to play on a game this game. So I see a little shine over there. And... Ooh, V-Star, that is cool. <coughs> Sorry. That is a cool one. Look at that in the back of that, too. But, dang, it doesn't have that, um, I don't know what it is. I think some V-Stars have, like, a golden thing. Like, it'll be, like, either, but it'll be, like, gold down here. I know I got that for my, um, Silver Tempest card that I got. I was able to put that I got like a gold version of it and then I got a Lugia just like this but it didn't have that gold on like the bottom here so I think that like if it does because I see it was like the same card but it had that gold on it and I'm like oh I wonder if it's worth more if it does and look at that that's nice that's a that's a cool card and again we'll have those um price tags for you at the bottom we'll see if anything is uh worth anything that is the goal Trying to make my money back with these. Because, you know, I don't have a ton of money. So it's, it's also always cool to get a rare card. I got a Charizard V Max from Darkness and Blaze. That, um, that full art one. I was really happy to get that one. Four. We can kind of breeze through that. Energy. Another one? Oh, no, just a hollow. And then a cleaver. Nice. I got that, uh... Trainer cleaver from this one too already. That's up with my um other cards that I have, but it's very cool. Put that right there. Next pack. I'm trying to think of stuff just to say and stuff. I'm opening these and just provide good content. But I don't know you guys just want to see the cards that you guys get. It's always fun. 
Um, I know when I watch people open up Pokemon cards, it's always cool just to see what they get. Because you're like, oh man, energy. And we got, well, that's kind of cool, a Reggie Drago. I think I'm saying that right. I know they had that Japanese promo card that you could get. Um, that's a cool card. I know that promo card was worth like nothing. Though. Like I saw it was like, people were saying like $3 while I was watching videos on that. And I did end up buying that. And I ended up returning it because I was looking at it and I'm like, you know, there is some definitely value cards in there, but it's similar to Silver Tempest in a way. And there wasn't a ton where I felt like I wanted to get it, but it's that Japanese mystery box that they came out with. So I got another black background. So we got an energy, Magneton, Electrolyte, Route, Nicket, Togepi, Chitat, Magnemite. Feather Ball and a Reverse Hollow. Gal Galade, Galad. My, my, my bad. Pretty nice though. I don't sleeve up my um Reverse Hollow cards. I don't know if I should. I don't typically do it just because I don't think that those cards retain much value. You can, but I just find it as a as a waste for what I'm going for right now. Like I'd rather much rather sleeve up like this and put it in the top loader than I would rather like a Reverse Hollow. Just to help save room. Alright, we're about almost halfway with the first section of these. I uh, was going through eBay for booster boxes. Some dude was selling like just this half of these, not the other half. I'm like, that's kind of weird. But four more, got another white one. So energy. Go through this. There it is. We got a, a deal watt. I, I think I said that right. Nice hollow, put that right there. Rapidash. Uh, let me grab these. Put that off to the side. Yeah, let me know what you guys think we're gonna get for the uh, the secret card. I'm kind of excited. I've seen that sometimes like the, the actual normal version rather than the secret card. Like the normal one is end up worthing more than the secret, which to me is just kind of weird because I feel like that would be a harder one to pull. And people are like charging more for the normal. Maybe the normal one looks cooler. Ooh, that's cool. Another kind of, I don't know what to call these cards. They're not necessarily like full arts, I think, but I know they're not like, like trainer cards either. They are, regardless, though, very cool. This is a... It involves from the Stantler. Sorry, let me get that back in there. I was just putting on that sleeve, but... Put that in the top loader. Very nice. So then we got two... Trainer cards, kind of. I'm going to call them trainer. And we have two normal ones, so I should put that on the bottom. Pick up these... Trying to get through this not necessarily quickly. I could be taking my time with these a little more. I see we got another V Star. V Star card. Put that off to the side. Put those over there. So even rising. A little swine, a scyther, quillfish, ashwat, hoot hoot, paywinard, with a nice little hollow, and ooh, a sneasel V. All these cards look really cool for some reason. Like I'm looking at like other booster boxes I've gotten. I've looked at these. These ones just these art styles. Maybe, like I said, we'll have the value of these cards. And I'm at the end of the video. I might go back and like after i've done like a little more research on them see what i've gotten see if these cards are rare it might be that these are just good cards but probably not i know that these can be full art but my theory is that these are probably just normal v cards and i'm just getting overly hyped up thinking that oh wow this is a good card and it's probably not no energy though interesting i can see that i got the little pile over there it's foreman it's all right Or my fridge it's to my left right now, which is why you might hear that humming sound. Maybe it's coming, I don't know. Energy. 
energy, water, hollow, and another Reggie Drago. I think I got a um, hollow Reggie Drago. We got a dark patch. Put that off right there to the side. White background again. Two, three, four. Energy. Uh, nice hollow Yan Mega. As well as from that one. I know what that card is from Pokemon Go, but. And then a Reggie Rock. I like Reggie Rock. Reggie Rock's really cool. The Reggie cards in general are just cool cards. Not anything but they're actually the Reggie Drago. That card is not cool. It's just not good. Maybe it is. There might be one that's worth something out there, but I don't like it. It looks weird. I got a, um, this from the Silver Tempest. I got a secret Reggie Drago. But I was like, mm -hmm. With the V-Star one, we got a nice black background. Hopefully we get something good. Energy. Ponyta. Bronzer. And ooh. Ooh. And so we got a reverse hollow Absol. That actually looks really cool. And then we got a Kingdra. That Kingdra art looks sick. I like that rainbow effect that they had. I don't know if you saw that. Um, This one had it too. It had that rainbow effect on it. But those are cool. I'll go ahead and sleeve that up real quick. That's a cool card. Dang. Just, just the art though. Like I know people say the Japanese ones. Art looks cooler. And I've yet to actually own a Japanese card. And see for myself whether that's true. But I, I believe it. I'm sure it is cooler. But, to me, I know that these full art cards, in general, they look cool. I know this is probably isn't a full art, but that is a nice card. Put that off to the side. Take that Absol Energy over here. Put that to the side. Alright, so we got, we're, gonna, we're flying through this right now. We still got, um, one, two, three more packs on this side. Dang, that's kind of crazy. I know there's uh, 36, so there's 18 on each side. So this would be uh, 15. Energy. Not that many pulls. Hopefully the other side will have more. An Iridia. I did not say that right. And a Reggie Alika. That one's actually cool. I do like the Reggie Alika. That lightning one. That's a cool one. And then, of course, we got that hollow. Put that that pile over there. Two more for this side. And then we'll see if we get anything good from the other side. I think it's like a nice black one. It does. So what we get. Energy. Nose leaf. Shell down. Oh, that's a cool one. Scyther. Voltorb, oops, Glamio, Admin, and a Reverse Hollow, I'm not even going to try, we got a Hollow, and then we got another Reverse Hollow, that, move that over here, I know my commentary is kind of plain, it, it'll get better with time, I promise. And a white one to end it. Or the, this side, at least. Hopefully the other side has a lot more good ones. Oh, I see something. Ooh, a Radiant Green Ninja. Ooh, that is cool. I got a Reggie and a Reggie Steel. But, well, I, actually, Reggie Steel might be one of my favorite Reggies. But I got a Radiant Jurchari, I think, from the Silver Tempest. But these Radiant cards look sick. I don't know if you can see that. Look at that. That is amazing. I love that effect on it. I don't know how they do that, but that is cool. I am going to sleeve this one up and put that in there. Because I think, I know they don't have like um, many radiants within sets, but that is a cool one. Put 
put this in the top loader. Oh, I wish I had my other ones down here with me. I could show you, kind of compare it to my Reggie Jachari, but it's fine. They're the same. That's cool, though. Put that over here. So let's see. We got two, six, seven. I guess six if you don't count this one. So we got seven um, good ones. This one might be the best one so far. I'm not too sure. That one might be. I have no idea. Like I said, we'll show it up and I'll go back over and see later on if these cards are any good. Probably not, at least so far. But we'll see. You guys might already know. You'll be like, how does he not know? That's like a full art, but it's probably me. Open this one. Probably a nice white background. Yep. Another V Star card. Jeez. It's three. And. Nice one. And this Arcane 9. That's a cool one. I know the Japanese version was something like this. They had a Japan one. It was like a V, and it looks sick. But that's the uh, the hollow that we got. Water hollows are really cool. Might be one of my favorite. Put that off to the side. Three V-Star cards right now. And that pile to the, is just growing. Or my OCD trying to make everything line up with the cards. Oh, uh, yep. Get a nice full art. Come on. Energy. Ooh, Mr. Rhyme. Mr. Rhyme time. Nice view. That's cool. That's probably just a normal one. But. And on top of that, it's a Galarian Mr. Rhyme. Sleeve that up. Put that in the top loader. Top loader ready. That's the top. Put that in there. Just like that. And then put that in there. So nice. We got a nice Mr. Rhyme. First one on that side. Mr. Rhyme. Oh, and I got this. Hollow Cricket, or Crick Dot. I gotta work my pronunciation with these cards. <laughs> Put that off over there. Still got a good amount of sleeves left. Another black one. Energy. I see something back there. It's just a ponyta. It's Rapidash, and that's kind of cool. It involves some of the like the dinosaur-looking guys. You know, you guys probably know, but Rapidash and a Reverse Hollow. Put that off to the side. And the Hollow Reverse Hollow pile. Put that over there. Still got like 16 more cards to go through. Uh, 15, I think. My bad. 15. in a row. Dang, I'm looking at that pile. Let's see. Energy. Heavy Ball. Hippodon. Dark Patch. Chitot. Magnemite. Teddy Rusa. Sneasel. Mischievous. Super Effective Glasses. And... Ooh! We got our secret! That is cool. Look at that. That's the, um... Typhlosion. I think. I hope I'm saying that right. Dang, look at that. That is cool. Secret Typhlosion. Hopefully that's worth something. We'll see. That might be one of the best cards. That's a cool one. That'll be my fourth. I believe it's my fourth um, secret card that I've gotten. Put that in a top loader. Let's get this one in here nicely. We'll see. Hopefully that one's worth something. You guys already know, but we'll see. 
All right, cool. We got that secret Typhlosion V Star. That is sick. Oops. There you go. Yep. Put that down a little more. Yeah, that is nice. Put that off to the side. That's a cool card. And then I got those super effective glasses. All right. I don't know if it's possible to get two secrets and one booster box. I've opened up. This is my fourth booster box, I believe, in my time. So I get to experience it. I'm sure it might be, but I know it's for sure one. This one, I'm sure it's just a normal one. Yep. Wait. Energy. Unidentified fossil hollow. Put that off to the side. There. All right, yeah, that Typhlosion V star is cool. Open this up. Hopefully, it's worth something. Wait. Uh, energy. Combi. Hollow Combi. And then another Reggie Rock. I like Reggie Rock, but, you know, I don't want too many Reggie Rocks now. Put those cards up. something good come on energy sweet honey hollow and reverse hollow I already have this card I already have a reverse hollow mess spirit come on now when do you get that hollow but I'm pretty sure I have a mess spirit I don't, actually, I know I have a mess spirit. I don't know if I have a reverse hollow mess spirit. I might. I know I have that card, though, for sure. It'd either be in my... It'd be in my... It's either a hollow or reverse hollow that I have that. If it's a... Hopefully, it's a hollow. Then I'd have both. Light back around. Four. Last card looked a little damaged. Energy... Where's the, uh, did I skip it? Oh. Oh! Ooh, that was not a white one, too. Dang, a V. That's sick. I was wondering where the card was. I'm like, wait, where's the, it should, it should be like a hollow or, or uh, yeah, hollow. I didn't see it. And then the Zam Z V comes out of nowhere. And I was thinking, I'm like, you haven't got a trainer, or, um, you know, Pokemon trainer card. I'm um, like, I, I don't know what these are called, but. In a while, and then I'm looking and I'm like, oh, there it is. Card's looking nice. I have a Zamzetta V from, uh, I think, Darkness of Blaze. But that's looking cool. I'll have to fix the um, alignment with these later because actually I can, might do that now. Kind of line that up more so when you put it in there. There we go. This looks, looks a little better. Yeah, nice though. Nice thing is that a V. I'm gonna put that on the um, right there behind the Kingdra. I'm gonna keep that Typhlosion on the top. I like that. And then put these off to the side. This pile's getting ever bigger over here, and we got this so tons and tons of cards. Throw away all these packs and figure out where I'm gonna store my um my trashy cards. I got a stack for my hollows and reverse hollows, but I gotta I gotta get another box or something for my um not good cards. Energy, oops. No oh, feather ball. I looked net ball. You saw that hollow, but we did not see that last card. So good thing we're not spoiling that. Why dear? I got that one and. Cleaver V. That's got to be a full art. That's got to be. 
that looks like a full art. Is it good? How's that look? It's got a little, little minor stuff here. But, yeah, that's cool. It does look like a full art to me, but I'm probably wrong. It's probably not a full art. Put that there. Nice cleaver. Um, yeah, sleeve that up. Put in the top loader. We'll be on our way. Yeah, full arts though, they, you can, I, I feel like I can usually tell, like, they have that look to them that just, like, kind of screams full art, like, it's kind of like, like, it just looks different, like, it just, like, the full arts to me look like they just have, like, a better art style to them, and I'm really not lining these up with these top loaders, it's bothering me, but yeah, that's a, um, that's cool, hopefully it is, uh, well, I'll know in a bit, but, Dang, yeah, hopefully I'm not ruining the card by readjusting this. Put that in that top loader right there. There we go. Very nice. Put that cleaver on top of that Mr. Rhyme. And then we got that uh, hollow. We're getting about, so far, about the same as we did on the other side. And we still got like six, maybe like eight more packs, I'm thinking, just guesstimating how many there is another, another black one all right good energy deal a lot I see something shining back there oh oh and an Obama snow and Okay, how many did we... All right, so we got this one. And then we got an Obama Snow single strike. So two good ones. Very nice. Go ahead and sleeve. Oh, I probably should have not set that down. Go ahead and sleeve this one up. I was able to pick it up. This one's kind of bent to it. So I was able to just kind of scoop it up from the back without having to like drag the card on the table and ruin it and i still gotta get that one though and then we'll put this one on the top loader i am gonna line it up this time i'm not gonna mess it up make sure i put the card in there nice lower that into there gently careful not to mess it up There you go, looking nice. Put that right there, and we have the Obama snow that I gotta get. That's a cool one. Yeah, I think these are like trainer Pokemon cards, kind of like it has a um, like it's not necessarily like a like a V, but it's like a new kind of style to that. Pick that up. Put that in the top loader. And then put that in there. All right, it's looking good. Now put that on the bottom on top of that Radiant Green Ninja. All right, so we got the stack so far. Plenty of good cards. Hopefully more to come. We still got like, like I said, like a few more packs in there. A few more card sets. This pile is getting a little big. I might go ahead and actually throw this away right now real quick because dang there's a ton empty those out though get a little less of the clutter and we got the v star cards and we got about a few more packs left like i said still room for a ton of good cards maybe a full art if i haven't already gotten one I should know how to say that. Voltorb. Elect Electroid. I'm so mad at myself that I can't pronounce these names. 
Drifloon, Stantler, and a Reverse Hollow. Both very cool cards. We got our nice Reverse Hollow. Then I already have you. I think I have you as a Hollow. I might already have you as a Reverse Hollow, but. I mean, all right. Pick these up. Probably ruining the card by scraping at it right there, yeah. Okay, we'll go ahead and create a second pile. I'm actually gonna remove some of the cards from here and figure out where the next energy is. Right there, just to kind of free up some space. We have like two mat. we have one massive stack. We have two decently sized stacks. And our fourth V-Star card, okay. Nice Absol, we got that reverse Hollow Absol, you know, I got that um, Hollow Absol now. And then, the super effective glasses that we saw earlier, and I got that Hollow in. That, put that off to the side. So it looks like we got about one, two, three, four, five. This is our sixth one left. We got five more chances. I got six if we get something good from this one. So six more chances to get something good. Well, more good stuff. Not to say that anything I've gotten is bad, but you know, really get some value in there. I don't think anything I've gotten so far is really worth anything. Energy. Hollow Sneezler. And I'm gonna move these over to here. I got a Togepi. I'll probably skip through that. Put that over there. Right. Four more packs after this one. My favorite card design is probably going to be this one, though. I like the way that one looks. Real fish. That one. Come on, I know we got some better stuff in here. Pretty sure I already have you. Put that in the back. Hopefully that you guys can see this. I know this, what I'm filming on like my phone, but I have a tripod connected and there's like the thing in front of the tripod that makes it like harder to kind of like see the center of the screen because it's blocking my view. And you guys can see everything fine, but for me trying to line up like the overall cards and everything in here, it just makes it a little more difficult. So, and I lose track also of like the things align. There we go. Come on, give me something good. Energy. I see something back there. It doesn't look too shiny, though. Hollow and reverse hollow cleaver. Seriously? You're going to give me a reverse hollow cleaver and a Datrix? Got to be playing with me right now. No, it's fine. We still got, like, three more. Okay, it could be, it could be that last one. I know I got that secret my previous booster box, I had like a secret as like my last pack. Like literally like my last one. I was like, oh. That's cool. It was a good way to end it though, so I am hoping that we do get something good to end it. Alright, there we go. Come on, show me the money. Trekking shoes. Oh, I see something shining. It's probably just a V though. Here we go, and Starry Me V. Starry Me. I wanted to Starry you, I'm just kidding. All right, let's sleeve this up, put this in a top loader. Get that protected. Group chat's been going crazy. Seen just a ton of messages while I'm recording this video. Either it's either with homework or it's with someone, some argument going on. I'm sure some of you can relate 
It's an argument. Let me right now. I'm, I'm, I'm recording Pokemon. I don't, I don't got time. Put that right there. Got the Arcane 9 V. I mean, Hollow, not V. Wish I had the Arcane 9 V. Arcane 9. That's probably how you say it. Arcane 9. It sounds better. And then we got this one. And then we got one more pack. White one. Energy. Ooh, radiant. Two, two radiants. I'm actually I'm okay with that. That's cool. A uh, heat ran, I think. That that's a cool one. I got that in my um Pokemon game that I'm playing. But not Scarlet or Violet. I've got to get Scarlet and Violet. They look cool, but. Key ran is nice. There's a little bit of something on this top loader. Let me get that off. All right, cool. That'll be my third radiant on all of them, and two radiants. And this one, I do like that radiant great ninja more. Both of those are cool, but I'm a bigger fan of that radiant green ninja. Just because I like green ninja. It's my two favorite Pokemon cards are like green ninja and uh, Lucario. I just like the one. Yeah. Last pack. Hopefully we get something good. I think it's white. In the back. Let's see. Dang it. Maybe a trainer in here. Uh, trekking shoes. And then a bravery. Alright. So I know typically the average pull count for most of these, let me go ahead and throw these away. Is anywhere between I've heard I've heard it to be I think it's between nine to twelve is the average pull count. Now we got a ton of hollows in reverse hollows in the hollow and reverse hollow pile. But I'm curious to see how many good pulls we got. So we got the average. It was a tear box. So we got the secret typhlosion, the starry me. That's three. This cleaver, I hope that's a full art. Four, five, six. This uh, Darkia V Star is cool. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. This name's out of V. Uh, twelve, I think. Thirteen. So I get a little over, I think. I'm not going to count these two radiants as um, poles. But. If I counted correctly, I probably messed up. I'll do a recount. Thirteen, yes, those so thirteen pulls. That's the doorbell. But a little over the um the average, and if we count these two, we have about fifteen, which isn't bad. I will take that. I know I got like like nine pulls one time or like eight pulls from like my first booster box and i was and i found out later on that that was not good i was like dang uh again you guys can see the uh the value of the cards and i'm gonna do a little more research after i'm done with this but let me know what you guys think on these videos if i should do more i know this i'm looking at the recording time about 45 minutes so hopefully we can cut that down a little bit but let me know what you guys think of these kind of videos I love to do more. Again, I'll work on my recording skills and make sure that you guys can see the pictures clear. But yeah, let me know if you want more Pokemon content or if you like me to keep with the uh, Star Wars or action figures content. Thank you.